welcome everyone thanks for watching this video in this video I'm going to explain the process how to upgrade the Nexus 9k switches on Cisco ACI fabric uh, I have already up uh, uploaded the image for the Nexus 9k switches leaf and the spines it's very simple the firmware for the controller is already been upgraded uh, you can go and check in my previous video how to upgrade the controllers but in this video I will focus only uh, uh, the process on upgrading the switches here you can see there are there are two spine switches and there are two uh, leaf switches they're running 6.03d version right now so we are going to upgrade the same image like 6.05h uh, I have already uh, uh, uploaded the image 64 bit you can see here under the images folder uh, it's available there it's 64 bit and it's the same image version 6.05 inch you can see here you can also validate it's a 64 bit running uh, image uh, 6.03 D uh, version so to upgrade the the Nexus 9K switches we need to go to the switches and here we need to create the groups so all the switches are here uh, you will see the summary and you'll see the analytics here so we need to create the group here so the group will go like the the uh, the, the IDs uh, of, of the of the fabric node node IDs uh, will be divided into the odd and the even numbers uh, as per the standards. So you ch I, we would suggest to choose the odd nodes. It could be one leaf and one spine, could be more than one in, in one pod. If you have the multiple pods, you can choose one node, uh, the odd numbers and create a group from the multiple pods or you create a, a group uh, based on the, on the pods. So I have only one port and I have two groups. Uh, I will create two groups, one for uh, the odd uh, switches and one for the even switches. So here we will just select the switches and we'll name uh, the, the group. So let's say I have one port, so I would suggest to go with the port by port here. The port one, uh, or I will choose only the port And then put the name uh, of the uh, of the even or the node uh, or the even or odd uh, switches. So let's name it. And then we can add the switches from here. So even nodes and odd nodes are already categorized in two different tabs. You can see here. Uh, even nodes are here. Odd nodes are here. So First, I will create the odd group and I will choose uh, the odd nodes and we'll add it here in the in the group. So the, the no, all the odd nodes will be upgraded under this group one by one. So I will rename it. It's, it's a port one switch and the odd. So I will click next, which is in the bottom. Again, uh, the version selection of the of the uh, firmware you can choose here you can see 6.05h and there are different you know the options available so you choose and then I will click next here so in this one it will perform the validation uh, again the similar to the epic if you saw my previous video in the AP upgrade there was a validation of the different checks uh, here it is performing the checks for all the switches the the boot flash storage, the spine redundancy, the hardware compatibility, and PGP underlay, and the target from where everything is uh, is green, so we are good to go. Then uh, here in the bottom, there's a next. I'm click, going to click uh, again. This is the recorded video, so you cannot see that option. But if when you perform, you will see the next option here. You see the target version, and you see here uh, both the switches are selected. I will begin the uh, the installation of of the uh, firmware. You see the status is downloading the image. If you click on number two under the switches, uh, 
you will have the another window where you can see yeah so in this window you go here on the on three dots and you will see that option you you see though both of the the switches are here which are the old images so i'll go here rather and choose the no it's not here uh, the option is that's not block it's a maintenance policy the option is here yeah analytics false and different options are available no uh It's downloading the image. If I click, if I choose it and yeah, no, uh, the option should be. If I choose this, choose the group and then click in this arrow. Yeah, here uh, you will see the another window where you can see the download uh, status. Yeah. Uh, so right now we are upgrading the old switches. You can see the status of downloading the image. It's downloading the image on the switch itself. So it's ready to install. Yeah, here, uh, once it's ready to install for both of the switches, then we need to start to begin the, uh, begin the, gradation of the uh, firmware on the switches. So ready to install here. Uh, you need to choose both the switches and under the action you need to begin the uh, begin the upgradation. So yeah, begin the installation uh, if you want to go with the specific node or if you want to go with all the nodes. So begin the installation and you will see the status will change uh, here. It's installing the image. Yeah, and this is really good, showing the different status of all these nodes. So I'll move forward. We don't need to spend the time again uh, just to see the progress of all these switches. Okay. So under this, uh, uh, the pod one switch or nodes, both the switches are unreachable, means they are rebooting now. Uh, maybe you can also check on the console. What is the status here? Just log in on the console and see uh, the switch, switch is back online, but it uh, takes time to join the fabric again and uh, yeah, uh, sync all the policies from the fabric uh, epic. So this, the first switch is upgraded. Uh, you can see that our current version 6.05H, which is the leaf 101. And then the spine uh, switch is also rebooting. It's almost completed. You will just uh, sync the configuration from the uh, from the cluster or epic, and you will see it, it's ready here. So, what I'll do? Uh, uh, this is this is completed. Now we need to create another group for the even nodes. Uh, so we'll go again under here under the action, create the update group, and I will choose. Uh, the list, uh, the, the number of uh, nodes which are even numbers uh, as the node IDs. Add the switches and you see under the even nodes, you will find all the even node IDs, uh, no, uh, the switches available here. So click next and choose the firmware and then next again. It's run the validation and give if there is any issue there's no issue and then next so it schedule the, uh, the downloading the image on the switches you can verify what is the status so the switches are rebooting now they are unreachable 
as soon as the switch will come back they will join the fabric again they will sync the configuration and uh, you can see the status uh, of both the switches uh, with the current version you can see the first switch is completed and you see it is showing the current version as the latest one which we just upgraded yeah the both the switches are showing the current version now uh, and it should be completed we can see the status if we close it this window uh, and go to the the dashboard and here you see the version of all the switches is is the same yeah so thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe